So for today, we're going to be looking at the Omega Mechanos boots. If you guys don't know, it is being sold currently right now for from Eververse. So I definitely recommend you guys to pick it up. Hopefully, I'll be able to post this by like late Monday. If not, I'll have it up by early Tuesday. So that way, you, some people might still be able to get it. It is really good. I'm probably going to post a community post like after I'm done with this video. So like still monday so that way some people can get their eyes on it because i do think it is really cool and you just collect all of the armor so if you guys like the video like comment subscribe we really do appreciate because a huge portion of people are actually not subscribed so if you can do me a favor like comment sub hit the bell notification because that also does help other than that let's get into it so to start off we're going to be using this set for the hunters i'm gonna be honest with you i don't really like this set to be fair it is the boots faults because uh a lot of the blue in that does not change color specifically the inner pants and the left boot does not change color so it's going to be that navy which is why we went with dreaming spectrum um i really find unshaderable pieces annoying but i mean th this is destiny 2 we can't have nice things for the helmet superior visions cal for the exotic it's actually going to be liar's handshake with thalia's with the thalia's reach ornament for the chest piece virulent vest and then for the cloak near terra kiat cloak so this is a combination of a hunter look with a asymmetrical look i guess so thalia's reach is specifically being used here because there is an armor piece on the left side which equals it out with the omega mechanos specifically because the right side has armor so it kind of evens out weight wise which is why i really like that other than that i really have no other praise i mean like it looks fine it looks serviceable this is definitely like not something at my level like this is definitely like something someone does when they're starting out um and i i can't I hate that i sound kind of like pretentious about it but yeah the armor just does it like it's fine like genuinely i wouldn't mind doing this to be fair i have way better looks for thalia's reach so would i use this over the other ones most likely not because again like i have like a lot of night looks and some other weird ones as well so this one's definitely not like oh this is amazing because now it's like fine it's it's not the worst thing in the world but i'd be lying if i said that like oh this is going to take precedence compared to like the other sets because the other sets that i've made for thalia's reach is way better actually let me just show you real quick so here we are with uh my lists of sh fashion that i've done over the years well I think two years because I don't have a lot of the older sets, but yeah, I have a lot right here. So yeah, this one's like decent. This is the one I was thinking of when I said like nightly looks. This is like the one that I like a lot just because it goes really well. Like the armor here with the with the cloth here and then the other side's kind of like naked. Um, another nightly look, but this one I think is a little bit cooler as well. To be fair, this one's I, I feel like the boots are not the best because it's asymmetrical up here and then symmetrical down here but it still looks really cool um that one's terrible this one is probably my favorite just because of how fucking good it is and this was made for the solstice chess piece if i remember correctly um this one was more of a this when this when this helmet came out i'm pretty sure i made a look for that um that one's terrible i was going for like an egyptian look and this one i changed a few pieces as well um yeah this one's almost the same as uh this one it's just the fact that i'm using a different cloak and a different chest piece um this one combines these two together i think this one was first though if i remember correctly um this one is the improved uh assat or like the egyptian look i think this one is way better this one's okay ah that one's terrible i'll be honest with y'all <laughs> Uh, this is the old this is the oldest one that I have. This is how this originally looked back in the day So and this is an old one. This is definitely one that I made this one I think I made specifically because I was trying to make like an older set just in a new video And then this one is one of my favorites as well. So like I've done a lot of them. So Specifically with this ornament. So like this one this one and this one are like by far my favorite ones like hands down They just look really really cool. So yeah, I've made a lot of other sets. That's why I'm like this is okay like the set that i made is okay it's not the best it's not even like in my top five it's like at the bottom so hunters let me know what you guys think as for the titans i went with heart of inmost light with the bronze carapace ornament on it this one is obviously going for a vex theme and i think this is probably one of the better vex themes that i've done just well for titans specifically because i think the warlocks have that trophy or 
award because they're just theirs is amazing like legitimately the coolest vex piece i've made this one isn't bad i just feel like titans you really need a like better vex theme chess piece or vex theme piece in general because as much as i do like the bronze carapace it's more so the um the like really gross looking armor that we got in shadow keep it, that that raid i forget what it's called but that's the one we ended up getting and i'm not the biggest fan of it funnily enough it's a remake of the omega mechano set um that raid armor is so that's hilarious but for this one we're going to be using the new helmet from this season which is really really cool uh, the phenotype plasticity gauntlets the omega mechanos greaves like i've mentioned and then light of the great prism now if you don't have the helmet if you're watching this like in the future you can definitely just switch out the light of the great helmet i think that would be good like legitimately or if you were lucky enough to get the phenotype plasticity that's also a better option just because if you're not using like mercury vex chrome which is the shader we're using then the red on the phenotype plasticity helmet it, it actually just stays red so that's gonna be really cool that being said you don't really need that considering like for example the titans and or the hunters and the warlocks do really need that because uh both of the ornaments that are vex theme for them specifically some a boot ornament for the warlocks and the chest or actually boot ornament for both uh there's red pieces that don't change color so you definitely want a red piece in there so that way it is like thematic to the vex titans not so much you don't have an exotic or an exotic ornament that has a really good vex piece that has red in it um the only one you really do have is bronze carapace and again this one is pretty terrible which is why i ended up using phenotype plasticity because it has the white like glow underneath the armor which goes really well with the glow on the actual chest piece um overall the reason we're using Merc mercury vex chrome for this one is specifically because the helmet has red or i think actually that changes color so ignore me mostly because mercury mercury vex chrome is going to look good with the chest piece so really i didn't really have to think about this one too much to be fair i'm going to be i'm going to use mercury vex chrome for the warlocks as well but for a completely different reason but overall i think this might be the best one if i'm being honest just because it looks really cool i think it's really cool as an ornament for vex theme i don't really use heart of the most light that much to begin with but when I see ornaments like this or sets like this, it kind of makes me want to use it just to see if it looks or if the build is good. So that way I can just rock this fashion because again, I do think this looks super dope. Um, yeah, I really just hope we get more Vex themed pieces and specifically like actual Vex themed. I know the helmet the, that or, that set that we got is Vex themed, but it's more like Samurai Infusion Vex themed, which is cool. But I think the only usable pieces from that set for most classes will be like the helmets. And I think that's it. I don't really like any other piece for a dedicated Vex theme. So, so Titans, let me know what you guys think. And then last but not least, Warlocks. So the reason I ended up using Mercury Vex Chrome is because I wanted red in there. That's like the really most simplest thing is the fact that I just wanted a little bit more red in there because we're using Sun Bracers for this. Plus, we're using the Dauntsinger hood and the Dauntsinger bond. And the Virtuous Robes uh, has a glow on the actual chest piece. And I wanted to have a glow in there that at least reflected something with the chest piece. Granted, you could use other shaders. There's other shaders that actually give you that red. But I also didn't really want to think about this one too much because it's definitely not up there for me. Like, this set is fine. It looks decent. It's just the fact that like the boots, if they were symmetrical, I think the boots would be really cool, but they're not symmetrical, which pisses me off a little, which is also why I ended up using virtuous boots for this one because, or, or virtuous robe, I should say. The reason I use that one is because you can see the, the boots, you can see all of it. So I didn't want to like have a chest piece that completely covers the boots because that defeats the whole purpose of using the boots. So virtuous robes is, was just an easy choice that I came up with. Cause I was like, I'm going to use that because it's going to look really cool and funnily enough don singer hood was actually like last that was the last piece that i put in there um i just didn't know which i what i wanted i wanted something fiery because obviously i'm going with a sun bracers look with the don singer having the flame as well i was just like you know what i'll just use the don singer hood i don't really mind using those two pieces um because that's like one of my rules is i just can't combine the helmet with the chest piece for the warlock specifically because it just looks like one whole set so overall i think this one's really cool granted is it better than the titans i don't think so like this one is cool but i've done some better sunbracer sets before 
even with the base look like i think the ornaments are way better specifically the blue one but yeah i've made i've done like some really good sun bracer looks which i guess we can just go check those out i guess because yeah i actually really do like the warlock ones because they came out really really well so for the warlocks um yeah I, eyes of mercury is one of my favorite ornaments like almost ever i want to say that being said there are some other ornaments that i like are up there as well so i would say like top 10 this one easily is in there um this one's also really cool if you're using spear tip uh, orange 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 everywhere and then some blue highlights i think is really cool and there's a lot of feathers in there as well this one is one that i really really like just because you're using whispered sheen which is usually like a wooden theme but then the glow is that rich red like right here you guys can see it so yeah definitely really like this one as well i'm again eyes of mercury you're gonna see a lot of eyes of mercury because i i love that ornament uh this is another one it's basically almost the same as this one just different boots and helmet and bond but yeah you guys get the idea of what i'm trying to go for i'm usually always trying to combine like a solar look with it because obviously sun bracers has that fire there um this one is not the best i'm gonna be honest with y'all this one's really cool this also one is really cool and i think this one is decent so like yeah i've done a few of them but like for for realsies i think my favorite one is gonna be this one and like that's it i think that i think the one that i made is cool funnily enough i'm using virtuous ropes for this one as well but yeah like funnily enough like i think this set is really cool it is up there with the other ones but at the same time it's like i don't know it's really weird so let me know what you guys think i appreciate you guys coming up to this point i have a fuck ton of content that i have to go through now uh we got the the anniversary armor which thankfully i pushed that as far as fast as i could i am gonna be doing the voiceover for that one after we're done with this video and then probably posting that tomorrow i'm gonna try to post it as fast as i can so that way you guys can get that armor because i do think it's decent i know a lot of people have been saying that it's just blue armor which is very much i can see that like definitely is blue armor i still think it has a a place in your repertoire um it's just like depending on how, do you see the potential in the armor i definitely do i've had a lot of fun with the armor with the only exception being the warlock the warlock was pretty rough for me but the hunter and the titans titans specifically i think i had a little bit more fun with uh the hunters was cool it's just that the titans like once i saw the piece i had the vision and then came up with the look and it was like whoa this looks fucking cool so i'm really excited to push that out i'm also i think the space marine video should have been out by now let me know what you guys think about that i'm going to be covering space marine as well um the final fantasy 14 video will be coming up shortly because i, I hate i kind of hate that space marine 2 was the first non-destiny 2 game that i covered for fashion when final fantasy 14 right there for the taking because a lot of the fashion's already done for me like i play that shit like for fashion a lot so let me know what you guys think i appreciate y'all be safe i'll see you guys later